were drunk a lot, but we had nice little drunk walks around town and getting cans and done stores That's and the, then yeah. robbing the producers' money and getting a couple of pints of Jamie's. <laughs> yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Cheers, Craig. You know what I mean? Thanks, Craig. Yeah, Craig. Craig. Wherever you are, Craig. He's up there in the sky. Yeah. It was an original piece for all by itself, yeah, very yeah. poignant and uh, yeah. it stands out. Like. Stands out, yeah. Well, it's I mean, it's 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 really about I mean, basically, it's it's modern day Dublin. It's 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 people gone on a drug binge, you know what I mean? And they have their own issues, and they're not dealing with those issues. They're hiding it behind taking chemicals and just yeah. going deeper and deeper than a rabbit's hole. And that's what the film's about. It was a really good like working with the three lads. It was a really good environment for like being creative and kind of suggesting something. And they go, yeah, let's try that. And there was loads that like you know we just went with the flow, improvised bits. The fact that we were there, we could every day we could see the other scenes and we could sort of see how the characters were moving within the scenes so that when the following day if there was another director on and if it was a sequential scene or something like that, we know what was coming before, we know where the character is going. You know, so it was a moving. Like having those having three directors, the most important thing is consistency and making sure that's in place. So meeting up every day or going on set where we weren't the main director was so, you know such such benefits of it I think anyway each one of them are their own are their own type of dickhead <laughs> um, but good dickheads who sort of know what to do so it was good fun yeah. I think a big thing as well is like once we cast the actors and the roles we had actors who we trusted and we could work with them you know and we, we understood we knew that they got the characters when you have like actors that are so engaged and passionate, you really, it's just so amazing because all you have to do is give them the space and time to perform and just put the camera on them and they just really go for it. Yeah, we improvised about 90% of it. Yeah. But so the dialogue that. was good. Yeah. We've just come up with better stuff. Because yeah. I, think, I think we're going to win the Oscar. It's fun, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a fun film, you know what I mean? It's not like a dark, melodramatic piece, you know what I mean? It's, it's, it's hopefully people tap into it and enjoy it. You know? What's realistic about it is that it isn't a moralizing film where, you know, if, if someone takes drugs, they have to pay the consequences for it. It's a film where the characters take drugs and there aren't any, really, any real consequences. It's very important that you show how much fun drugs is, taking drugs. They're fucking great. Ecstasy, cocaine, whatever you like. They are great fun. And it's important that you show how much fun you have when you're on drugs. You know what I mean?